morning everyone we are here at pine view reservoir ready to fish and um as you've watched and seen i've been struggling fishing so far not catching many fish but now we're going after bass stuff that i'm really confident fish just jumped back there we had a nice sized bass jump right by uh, the launch here i can't wait to get on the water throw some top water and some other baits and see what we can get there's tiger musky there's bass there's stuff that i know when i'm chasing right more than than lake trout that's not my forte so we're gonna have fun, see these amazing views, and catch some fish. Wish us luck, let's hopefully we have some fun. Well, Chris and I have been out here for about an hour and a half and no fish. Our skunk is continuing, sadly. Um, beautiful area, gorgeous sunrise, and again, wonderful and beautiful landscape. With the colder front that kind of moved in, although it's still hot, this was cooler than it has been. I think has a fish a little slow to bite and we're just not figuring them out but we're gonna keep trying and keep pushing ahead and enjoy the views and enjoy the fresh air hopefully we can catch some fish but if not it is a beautiful area well we were out here for about three hours Saw a lot of carp jumping um, and some small schools of bluegill, which was awesome, but no fish wanted to come out and play. We threw everything at them, spinner baits, tubes, finesse, wacky, um, drop shot, like everything, and couldn't convince them to bite. Maybe we were in the wrong area, I don't know. I saw some other kayak fishermen who fish this area often, still couldn't find one. Oh well. I got the skunk with us. Maybe that should be a new mini series, right? See if I can remove the skunk. I don't know, something fun. But gorgeous morning out here. We're gonna head on in and then do a hike uh, up uh, Milan's Peak, I believe it is. Should be a fun hike there. And then after that, we'll go check out Beach Body or something like that and have some fun. All right, thanks for uh, watching and sorry we can't show you fun fish, but. Hopefully you're enjoying the views. Hey everyone, we're here at the Provo River trying our luck, uh, hopefully catching some trout. We heard what they're biting on, we'll see what we can do. Who knows, hopefully it's better than this trip, but uh, it's looking fishy, looking fun. It's Provo River, when you're in Utah, you gotta fish the Provo at some point, right? Let's have some fun. We are hiking the Bonneville Shoreline Trail up in the Rockies. We're having fun. Check out this view. It's about a 140 mile trail as of right now, if I remember correctly. We're maybe 6,000 feet up from sea level. Check out that view. It's a good hike, a lot of fun. When you're out having fun, chasing the, your passions to the max, you gotta live it up. We are here on the last day of our Utah trip, and I'll be honest with you, this was a rough trip. We haven't caught a lot of fish, but with that, every time that I get the kayak out and I get by the water, I'm reinvigorated with uh, happy thoughts, and I'm ready to go catch some fish and feeling confident. We are here um, at Teapot Lake. We are at about 9,500 feet above sea level. Uh, this is crazy. You can feel the thin air. It's crisp. It's beautiful out. 
we check out the lake behind us. You can see some fish hitting the surface already a little bit. We saw trout already, so this is already an amazing trip. We were originally going to go to Lost Lake, which a friend suggested, and we were driving up and we're right across from it. But comparing that lake to this lake, the views on this lake beat it 10 to 1, um, at least in my opinion. So we are here teapot. We saw three trout in there already swimming around, decent sized ones, like 12 inches, so maybe not huge, but decent sized trout. We got a trout bait this time, so we're gonna try some power bait and see what we can do. Having some fun. Another follow on the rooster. Dude, I'm getting chased left and right. Well, we are out here at Teapot Lake. Um, it's more of a really big pond, I would say, but we're seeing trout left and right. We just can't seem to convince them to bite. We got them chasing our lures, but not convinced enough to bite them. So we are mixing it up, changing cadence, changing colors. We know we're on the right track and they're chasing, but not quite specific enough of color or speed. So we're trying to figure it out. Let's see if we can do it. We've even tried a couple flies, but sadly they're not wanting those either. At least not yet. We'll see. Well, sadly, we have to close out our Utah trip. It's been an amazing trip. While the fishing might not have been hot for us like we would have liked, um, the scenery was amazing, and they do have beautiful fish here. We fished multiple lakes, ponds, and rivers, and just an incredible time overall. I'm excited to come back out here and hike and fish and get to know these waters a little bit better. If you have a chance, be sure to check out Utah and their wonderful, amazing nature that they have here, the lakes, the mountains, all of it. Check it out go and chase your passions to the max folks thanks for watching and please if you like any of these videos the scenery all that stuff please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel thanks for watching and we will catch you all in the next episode